Okay, so today I want to talk about the day my channel blew up. Because I saw Pallet do it on his second channel ages ago, and I thought, I want to do that. So I'm doing it. So I'm pretty sure this goes back to like September 2022, I think. Maybe even longer than that. And that's when I dropped my first ever Skulk video. The why I infected the world. Um, and just, just to give some backstory on that video, I was banking so hard on that video doing well. Um, if you didn't know, I dropped out of school like a month before that that video came out and at that point I think my videos were getting around 4,000 views <laughs> each video. My parents were awfully uh, terrified. I was terrified. I thought, oh no, I've dropped out of school. I can't go back and I I'm now a YouTuber with only 4,000 views on each video. Like that, that's, that's not gonna work out. How many? <laughs> What, what's going on? But I put so much time into that video. It was like three months of total work, which it, it, it's just a stupid amount of time. But I, I worked on it. I was recording for ages. I was on, on a server called Nemesis. And it was actually, the idea came from a guy called Smiley. So he invited me onto the server, we played a bit. We, he gave me the idea to go and infect the entire world. And we're going to do it as an, an entire team. So we did it. It came out really cool, actually. And then when it came down to editing it, it just took forever. I don't know why it took forever, to be honest. It, it was only like an eight minute long video. I just feel like, I, for some reason, that video, I just put my all into it. I, I knew there was so much banking on it. And it was like almost like a make or break at that point. If, if this one doesn't do well, I'm screwed. This one has got to be my best video yet. So I spent days working on like just the replay shots, the structure, the storytelling, the, the voiceovers. I was watching Hayden Hilliard Smith 24-7, which I do not recommend. I got way too artsy at some points in that video and it was not good at all. But yeah, even after making that video and putting them all into it, I showed it to my friend, that chief guy, uh, he said it sucked, so he gave me advice, it all went well, and I spent an extra week working on that. Pretty much every single note he said, I, I like, I did. To, like, exactly, because I think at, at the time he was doing really well on YouTube, or at least a lot better than me. So I thought, okay, th th this guy, it, it would be unwise not to do everything this guy said. I mean, looking back now, it probably wasn't the smartest idea to do everything someone tells you to do, because it, it, almost, it almost makes your video turn into their, like, video style, which... I do think sometimes people focus too much on little things when it's actually the bigger picture you should be, should, should be focusing on. But anyway, yeah, it comes to a day I upload, I made a thumbnail for it. Um, I actually saw this thumbnail by a YouTuber called... Oh, what is his name? Is it Asian Half Squat? Is that, is that, is that, I can't, can't quite remember, but I saw a thumbnail from him where it was like about the... It was about a mod called Distant Horizons, and I thought it looked so cool with the sunset in the background, and it was just like endless land, and he was looking out onto it, and I thought, how cool would that look if the land was Skulk? So I made my own version, I thought half and half, one side regular glass, other side Skulk, have a sunset in the middle, and I thought, okay, this is gonna look so cool. Uh, I, think I, I think I was in Tenerife at the time, so I was doing that on my laptop, and my laptop was burning so hot, especially when I've been doing it for like eight or nine hours, that thumbnail. On my laptop, it was like 40 degree, 30 degree heat. It was not a fun time. Yeah, finished thumbnail, finished video, and then I come to uploading it. The day I upload it was terrifying. I was on a call with uh, a guy called Lucid, Brandy, Wenzo, and Chief at the time, and I think maybe solely. I can't remember, but it was it was a lot. It was a lot of guys find some uh, Echo Craft because it was it was like the day I joined. I uploaded that video, and I just remember uploading it. I was just watching the stats, just like okay, how are the stats doing? How's the AVD? How's CTR? AVD? I think it was four minutes thirty. Which, um, if you don't know what that means, it means like it it it's the average duration of how long a viewer watches the video. So it was an eight minute video. The average viewer watched for over half the time. So uh, it was my best AVD at that point, so I was really excited. CTR was crazy, it was like 20% CTR for the first hour. Um, only got like, I don't know, like 100, 200 views first hour. But I went to bed, I woke up the day after, it had like 10k, 20k, and I thought, oh my god, it's a 1 out of 10, it's the best performing video I've ever had. It was crazy, it was doing beautifully. So I just I just remember that entire day, I was just stuck to the analytics. That in, uh, It was just, it was not healthy, but it, it is nice to sometimes, when, when when something's going well, it is nice to appreciate it. If it, if it was, if it did take a, a dip one hour in views, uh, it would be soul crushing, but it didn't, thankfully, that entire day, each hour it just went up and up and up. 
And I think to this day, I think it's still my second most viewed video in the first day. I think it got like 200k maybe for... No, no, a bit, no, a bit less than that. I think it got like 150k. But in the first week, it got a, it got over like a million, a million views. It's, it, no, I think the first week, it got like 1.2 million views, which was insane. I feel like you can't... It's hard to like explain that feeling when... When something you've been working on like so hard for for years and years and years, it finally just clicks. I don't know how to explain it, but it's 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 the best feeling. Yeah, and it only it only happens it happens once, so it, it it's good to uh it's good to cherish it. And even on that video, I think I was stuck at like 60k subscribers for like an entire year, and that one finally pushed me to that 100k mark. Um which was awesome getting the getting the silver plaque. So again, everything it was it was it was great. It was a good day. It was a good day. And I guess after that, I made the ocean one. I made a biome one. Made the flood and nether one. And and it, you know it it's history from there. Wait, no, hang on. No, no, the rest is history. By the way, I'm doing one of these every single day for the next. 30 days. So if you want to have daily miles content, consider subscribing. And if you have any questions for me to answer, uh, drop them down below. Um, because I'll try and get back to you. Uh, yeah. Bye.